Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to be showing you how to do a potato farm. Auto potato XP farm. Oh. And that's what we're going to be doing for today's video. All right, well, let, let's just get into it. Yeah, let's just get into it. So, here we are at the build, and this is, um, you can build it anywhere, really. And for the stuff you're going to need, you're going to need some coal. Or any other fuel. Yeah. That's not, like, kelp fuel. Because, no, you actually have to have coal. Because no other fuel works in smokers but coal. No, no, no. Kelp works in there, too. Kelp blocks, they work, too. And coal and charcoal work in there. Okay. I had the, all those in my farm. But the coal is easy to come by in our, in our survival world. Um, but our kelp farm can make some, too. Yes. So you're also going to need... Potatoes. Probably you're going to make a potato farm, which will help. Um, you're going to need three chests, one smoker, and the opera. So this is how you're going to do. You're going to have to place a chest any of the direction you probably want to do it this way. Then, okay, you're going to place a hopper next to it. Don't do this. That is bad. You know where you went wrong? It's not connected to the chest. You actually have to shift, go behind the chest, and press. Whatever button is placed in your thing. Now you have it connected. Now, you want to place another chest. Mm. Actually, no. Wait, no. You want to place a smoker on top. Which Now that you have your smoker on top, you want to go to the back and place a hopper. Now that hopper, you see, is connected to the smoker. Now you should probably climb up and shift. Please, your hopper right there. Chest. Or mm -hmm. chest. Sorry, I get confused. And then... You up here, you're going to want to place another hopper. Whoops, I fell. Boom, just like that. You want to make it connected to that. Then, or the smoker. Then you want to place your another chest, and boom. So basically, that's it. I know, it's really simple. And basically, what you're going to do with the coal and stuff is the coal. You're going to put it in here. As you can see, the coal, where's it going? It's going in here and now the reason why we have a separate chest for it is because um you like they put it in so once all this coal runs out going into the um you know smoker right there all this coal is staying in there so once it's done it can go in because you don't want to have to grab place grab place grab place it's auto then in here you put all the potatoes potatoes yeah same reason for the coal while you're putting all of them in there and then they come into here start smelting and they go to this hopper into here and then here once don't take these out once all of this is filled up it might take a while when all that's filled up it they it shouldn't come through because it's clogged so then you can start taking them out and getting exp the reason uh, there is a reason why you shouldn't take these out though it like does something you know, XP involved. I'm not that smart. I don't know why. It just collects the the XP and then it charges the smoker when you take it out. Okay, yeah. So now we are going to hop into our survival world. Isn't that right, Dad? Yeah, and show you how it works. Okay. See you there. Okay, but before you do your build, first you're going to need a lot of potatoes. A lot of potatoes. So I recommend making a potato farm. Yeah, you're gonna want to farm them. Well, first off, you gotta find the potatoes, and yes. it took us literally like days. Like forever. We had to travel all over the map just to find a village that had them. We weren't getting them anywhere. Yeah, Dad found an abandoned one, and then he got the potatoes. Then we were adventuring. Dad, um, when like we went to go find the abandoned village, and then, um, you know, I found a new one that had even more potatoes and yeah that's really how we got all of our potatoes is that right dad yeah it was like actually kind of fun how many villages did you see because we found i believe we found well i found two okay you found, found two okay but i believe one of them was an abandoned one that had which, some which, zombie which villagers you found, right which I, I found the other two lively ones okay we also found this one well i found this one in the forest me and dad split up and I found this one in the forest, but like after we found the one, we were heading back home. It was really, it was like a forest one, it was really cool. I took their potatoes. Yeah, that was pretty funny. Okay, so I think we have enough potatoes to at least do what we're gonna do. So what we do 
is we will grab all these other ones and replant them. So over here is our potato farm, all right? So we have our three hoppers, our smoker, and our three um, uh, uh, chest. The back one, of course, right here is for our fuel. The top one up here, we open it up and we put our potatoes in there. And then the potatoes are then uh, cooked and sent down to the bottom one down here, right? We're almost there yet. We're not just there yet. So what happens is, is this is going to fill up and you don't want to fill it up. You want the smoker to fill it up. Um, and then what we're going to do is once that's done, the uh, smoker will get backed up, right? Because the hopper gets backed up too, right here. <laughs> this get backed up. Yeah. And then you'll pull them out. It's best to do it one by one. You get more XP that way, but it will um, build up the XP that's sit here in the chest. So the bigger chest you have, the more potatoes you'll need, but the XP kind of loads up. So that's how that works. So uh, we'll come back when we have um, some XP loaded up. Yeah. Oh, you guys, we are back with all the EXP loaded up. And if you come look, I'm level 106. I know, it works really, 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 really well. As you can see, I have a ton of potatoes. If you come in and look here. So if you, okay, if you take it out, Look, I just got it. Let me put these together. I just got like a one level. Listen, if you're low level, you get two levels. But okay, if the more potatoes that are in there doesn't mean the more XP. It's like one potato is equal to sixty-four potatoes. I recommend taking half because if you take half, then you can just go out, go in, and then boom, take it. You can't. Okay, so you see how I just picked them up without exiting. If it did it again, see it didn't work. Cause you have to exit and go back in, and then boom. And just remember, you have to, this has to be full. And then it's good cause all the other potatoes that you take out, you can just eat them. It's like a really good piece of I do recommend having a big potato farm. That's gonna be extra helpful for this, because you know that's what you got or you need. And if um, if we come over here. Keep going, just keep going. Let's go over here into our house. I know it looks majestic and amazing, and it's so cool. Come in here, go down. Look, we have level 30 enchantments. Smite, we got Fortune 2, and yesterday was Fortune 3, and we had Silk Touch. Um, so yeah. That's really, really, really good. Sharp, sharpness three, bruh. Dude, sharpness three is actually really good. good. <laughs> like that's actually really good. Dude, that's actually really good. I, I want that now. Well, anyways, <laughs> um, yeah, that's good. <laughs> if you have, look. We have, little, <laughs> we have a little dirty enchantments. Oh, I should probably go to bed. That's going to be worth it. You can get so many good enchantments. And, um, exploring. I got a kitty cat. My dad probably told you this. Maybe in a different episode. He could have. He got a dog. It died. And if you didn't know, find Minecraft it. If you make your cat sit up on your bed and sleep. Hold on, wait. I just going to wait for it to be able to sleep, guys. <laughs> okay, should we all sleep now? Look. Look, look at the screen. Look below. Look, the cat's sleeping now. Now you come. The cat will come. And then go there. And then you get a gift. Now, well, it's funny. Every time I get a stupid gift, it's always a rabbit for it. I don't know why. But it just always is. See, we have a ton of papers. We make a ton of bookshelves. All we need is a ton of, um, what's it called? Leather. And as you can see, we have, um, some farms. They're really good. Right now, as Redwood, we're doing really well. And yeah, that's all that we had planned for this video. I, um, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe. We do really appreciate it. We do really try really hard on our work to try to make things for you guys to see in for our survival world and yeah 
I'll see you guys later. Potato! Oh wait, no. Bye! Welcome to Wendy's!